Hey, what's up guys, TechNewBG here, and welcome to another League of Legends video. This video I've got a nice little Teemo gameplay here. It was actually the first uh, the first game I ever played of Teemo, so that was pretty cool. I was trying to learn what was best and stuff like that. Like, I've seen him played in a lot of games, and I've always wondered what he was like. And he he's a really good champion, I really like him. Um, I've certainly used him a lot this afternoon, or well, today, when I got him. And uh, he's he's been really fun. I was actually on like a horrible losing streak uh, prior to buying Teemo, and then when I bought him and I played him, and I just, I won and won a few more games in a row, and it was really good and really happy. So yeah, I'll just go through the basics and sort of my like strategy for playing this game with Teemo because it was like my first game, so I didn't really um, know too much about what I was doing. So the build I sort of went for. I ended up with the Berserker Boots, a Milady, a Nash's Tooth, and a Phantom Dancer. And that ended up maxing out my attack speed and giving me like 200 ability power and about 150 attack damage, which was pretty cool. And uh, that, it seemed to work well, and that was kind of kind of cool. But um, a few games later that I played, I really built up the ability power, and he was a lot more powerful than he was in this game. Just those games were like, you know... 15 kills, 10 deaths, and that would have been too boring to watch, so this is a fun little game here. And also, too, at the start, I really like um, his passive that he goes, like, invisible or stealth after, I think it's two seconds of standing still. That's really fun. You can play around with people there. You see at the start of this game where I sit there and I just, like, poke Diana down to half health just from being stealthy in there, but she ends up finding me. Oh, no, I do it two times, and then, yeah. I tried to do that in another game and I just got found out straight away so that wasn't too fun. So yeah, that was, um, that's like, I guess there is also too, I have like one of the best Baron kills later on in this game. I was like 4, 5 HP or something left after this because I was fighting it with the Wukong and the Alistair I think it was, yeah. And uh, they both, well no, the Wukong left and the Alistair died and it was like just me and Baron almost dropped me all the way down. But I luckily stayed alive, so that was that was pretty fun there. But yeah, now to get on to the main topic of this little video that I've got here today, and that is of the patch, like the recent, or well not the recent, the upcoming end of season, <clears throat> sorry, the upcoming end of season 2 patch, which has been delayed and delayed and delayed and delayed a little bit more. And um, I don't know, it's really confusing because usually patches come out on Thursday or something, that's what my... That's what my mate told me, something like that. And then I was reading on the forums, and they were like, yeah, we're just straightening some things out, so it'll probably be, you know, another day. And every day I go on, and I've been waiting, waiting. All I really want to do is play Zed and see what the rewards are for the end of Season 2. That's really my main aim. And if it did come out a bit earlier, this would have been a Zed gameplay instead of a Teemo one, but, you know, it's still cool. Teemo's good. So, yeah, I was just really... Wondering why the patch is taking so long because I mean, I don't know they've had to straighten a lot of things out, obviously, but I don't think it would have taken this long. Like four days ago, they announced the patch and it still, it still hasn't happened. And I'm recording this video on Sunday, so if it does come out on Monday when on this video gets uploaded, it'll look a bit silly, but I know it's still enjoyable to watch, I guess, just because of the, I oh, don't know, the, the topic. Which is cool, and because it's the end of season two, which means everyone's elo restarts as well, which I'm pretty proud of because this weekend I decided to play some ranked games, and it was terrible, and I didn't win a single ranked game. So now, before the weekend, I had one win and one loss, and I was sitting on like, I think it was estimated like 1,200 on something elo, and um. So I was like, oh yeah, I'll play a ranked game, you know, what's the worst that can happen? And the worst happened. I lost the game. And I was like, oh, no worries. One win, two losses. I'll play another one once, you know, I can't lose two games in a row. And then I lost that game as well. And then I was like, alright, okay, I can't lose this one. Try it again, and I lost. So now, as it stands, at the end of Season 2, I've got one win and three, three, four losses. So... That was pretty unfortunate. I didn't really like that so much. But, um, I know, I just got paired up with really bad team comps. 
and um, it, it sort of didn't work together. But the bad thing about ranked games is that I can't play with any of my good friends because they're all on like 1.5k EO. No, not all of them. 1.3k, 1.4k, around about there. And that'll sort of put me in an unfair... Well, I mean, we might win, but it'll be a lot tougher than me trying to win by myself. So that's why I don't really play too many ranked games until I get better myself at the game. So I'm probably not... I'm at the moment... Sorry. At the moment, I'm on about 140 wins. So that's kind of a low amount of wins. I'm probably not going to start playing ranked games until I'm at least 200 wins or I'm like feel really comfortable and you know find a champion that I really like to play and that doesn't get banned all the time like Shen and stuff like that then I'll probably play ranked games but yeah I really I really straight off topic with this video and I'm sorry about that the main thing was to talk about the patch and how it hasn't happened and I'm sort of oh no I'm not really like annoyed annoyed but I'm a bit annoyed because I was really looking forward to playing Zed this weekend uh, with my mate and that would have been really fun but it didn't happen so so poo so hopefully it does come out this week and they don't uh, prolong it for another week because that would just be annoying but yeah anyway this video is coming to an end so if you guys are still watching and I hope you are cause, you know that'd be cool thank you very much for watching I hope you've enjoyed the video if you do please give it a like because it you know really motivates me I guess and sort of helps me out a lot which is cool and um, yeah, if you do like the content, I have a few more League of Legends gameplays and stuff like that on my channel. I've also got a video uh, featuring the new Darius skin that will also be coming out in the end of season patch, which looks pretty cool. So yeah, you should go check that out on my channel. And um, so yeah, thank you guys for watching. If you do like it, please give it a like. If you like my content, please subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Have a nice day.